Max here. Uh, today I'll be showing you another video of how to draw art in a, uh, it's like a concept thing. I'm not showing you like how to draw specifically, it's just more of a concept. And I'm using Photoshop and my drawing tablet. This drawing tablet is called XP Pen and it was a good $39 and there's a cheaper one which I believe is $14. So I'm not flexing rich this photoshop don't worry about where i got it from it you can use uh fire alpha i believe it's called which is pretty good because you can have a little reference board over here if you want to like draw oh shoot where's my pen pencil if you want to draw some stuff here and i need to change that color it's really ugly but yeah you get my point and another thing you don't have to have a drawing tablet. You can try to do this on your mouse, which is a skill that I not I don't possess. Cause like, who can draw with the mouse? Oh, apparently it's not working. But you get my idea. I can't draw with the mouse. I doubt you guys can. If you do, I more props to you. But yes. Just these are basic easy steps. You can do this off your phone if you don't have a computer or the setup that I have, which is really cheap. Um, you can use Adobe Sketch, which are mostly for mobile phones, not tablets. You can use IBS Paint, and those are two things I suggest using. Or you can use Adobe Illustrator, which is pretty abstract, but that's for more for of filling in line art and things like that. So uh, number one, uh, your spears, uh, I need this brush thicker, is that thick enough? That's thick enough. So, um, we're going to be doing a 2D style, which is like facing the side, so I don't know how that's supposed to work. 2D, yay. Um, I have to bring up a reference photo. Not really a reference photo, but I learned this from a photo. If my phone cooperates with me, uh, that's not it. I have to find that. I just downloaded it like today. Okay, there it is. Uh, blah, blah. If you are good at quote unquote sketching, sketch, a lot of people usually say they're not good at sketching, they're good at, uh, just drawing from scratch which is okay yeah you can do that I mean it's not going to be perfect but if you're skilled at it yes it can be perfect which I'm not as good at doing that at all I really am not because I have to literally map out what I'm doing and I don't I'm not good at that which this I'm surprised it turned out well and it actually didn't because I messed it up a bit but you get my point. Uh, yeah. You get this. This is just from scratch. Um, and then you have, shoot, I need to fix this eraser. Bigger brush, please. So satisfying. <coughs> It's like 8 a.m. right now. No, not 8 a.m. 8 p.m. My bad. Ah. Then you have where you have uh, schematic or just sketching kind of of an I general idea of what you're trying to do. That's not 2D at all. Um, how to do this? Uh, let's see. You're gonna have a spear. And then the cross, which would be in any angle if you think about it real good. I don't know, I'm not a good thinker at all. And then you're going to have a muzzle, which would, if you know geometry, 90 degree angles would be a square in a box like this. Like this. That'll be a 90 degree angle stuff. Stuff which I 
really easy. I don't know. So what you want to do is create your muzzle, the mouth, the front of the face like that. And then have your nose here kind of. I wouldn't suggest drawing the nose yet, but and have the nose there. Then droop it down a little for the mouth. It depends on your art style. Like, you can draw your faces like... Ah, oh, shoot. Yeah, how to do this? You can draw your muzzles like this. Really blocky. Ah, oh, shoot, I can't draw for crap. I really can't. You can draw your faces really blocky, like, for... Uh, animals like bears and yes I'm doing this only for furries I do not know how to draw a human don't even quote me on that I do not know how to draw a human but yeah then you're going to have this uh, I forgot the, the jaw you kind of sketch out the jaw to get it, to find out where it might be where it look good I don't know I'm not good at drawing I'm going to say this again Okay, then you have the chin. Oh, I just messed up the mouth. Don't worry about that. Freckles, because why not? We love freckles. Freckles are cute. Whiskers, because apparently I'm drawing my persona. Who cares? Uh, usually, I don't know why I have a tendency to do this when I'm drawing my persona heads. They tend to be really long. Like, really long. Like, such as this. I don't know, this is really crappy. His hair will be all the way up here. Yeah, I don't I don't know what I'm doing anymore, I really don't. <clears throat> right here. Okay then. You have the cross, I need to change this. Zoom in a bit. You have the nose. I'm going to restructure the nose to find out where I'm pointing this in a perspective. It should be an invisible horizon line. If you get that from school, oh well, oof. Then you're going to have an eye. I can't draw eyes, I'm just going to do this because it's just a little doodle style I've been picking up just for the week. Then, if you're wanting to draw ears, like draw kind of a holish type of thing. Just another spear on a spear. Not a spear. A circle on the spear. Like a hole. And then kind of sprout it out like that. That looks like I'm making a wolf now. Ah, hold on. It's not going to be perfect, but you can get around it off right here. Swoosh. And then if you want to know where your ears should be, if you had less hair than I do. Kind of draw a line that's eh, right there. I don't know. That would be where your ears would be. Which I'm not good, so I think that's where my ears will be. And then hair. I don't know how you guys draw your hair, but I like to just wave it out. Like, this is what I mean. This muzzle here is too long. And over here, needs to be shoved over there. But, I'll fix that later. This is just concept. This is how I draw my art. I'm not here to tell you how to draw your art. I'm here to show you the concepts of how to probably sketch. Or, get a good idea of how to draw a head. I'm not going to be doing bodies anytime soon until I'm really good, but yeah. I draw my hair really messy. Ignore it. You get the idea though. The front of the face, I'm still having issues, but you can, you can get something out of that. Then, from here would be probably his neck. Always gotta like look like this. Not this. Hold on. Don't have your neck like this. That's a bad neck. That's a real bad neck. I mean, it's not bad, but it's really thick. Have it from, like... 
start from here where you near your jawline and just swoop from there not a half bad neck and I'm still not good at art so I can change this anytime I want to in the future I'm still practicing it like I've been doing this a lot non-stop and then sometimes I have problems with like the front of the head where I can't tell how to shape it but I draw hair over it just to hide the fact I can't draw heads yes you could get an idea from that that's still kind of it's not 2D-ish but it's still eh then you have front faces which should be facing the front I don't feel like okay I'm going to create a new thing Please load. Uh, custom. I'll just use another 1081 because I waste space. <laughs> okay, then you're going to have the front face. There are many ways you can draw the, the front of your muzzles, but I only know two ways to draw them, and I'm still not freaking good. Uh, what you're going to have to do is draw across again. Ugh. This is real messy. It's not even a cross, brother. <laughs> then you're going to draw one more cross up here. I don't do this all the time. Then another circle, which would be the muzzle of your face, depending on the size. It can be a block. I haven't tried that yet, but yeah, this is really off already, so I'm going to mess up. But yeah, draw a circle there, and then, let's see, the nose. Nose would be like this. There's still different many way, different types you can draw your noses in the front. I usually like start off like this, then a little line here, like a little dip for the, the muzzle. Ah, come on, draw. Like here, another, like, two dips. It really depends. Or you could do this. Ah, don't do that. That's not even the middle. Or you can do this. <coughs> Where it's slightly defined, but yet not. It's like real abstract. It really depends. <laughs> I have gone through a cold, so leave me alone about that part. But yeah, you get it from there. <laughs> Oof. I'm still not good at art, but it feels good just to sketch some of this stuff. That was a crappy chin. More from the side, though. <laughs> okay, am I even. I haven't done any of that until over here. Uh. Okay, you got the top of the lip. From there. I'm gonna do this style. Because why not? You have a little dip there to just more define the cheeks that are over here. I'm not good at this, so help me. If this is terrible, don't blame me. A little space here, which would be the bottom of your chin. <laughs> and then have a little dip there. Tad bit of a dip. I'm going to fix it later if it's wrong. But you get my point. <laughs> then you see you have a circle here. Then probably face fluff. This is going to be a really thick face and I'm not good with thick faces. E let's do that. <laughs> mm, this is really off. Well, like I said again, I'm not good. 
Then eyes. I'm not good at eyes at all. And I don't I really don't like drawing two eyes. So my hair covers my eyes. So I'm just gonna draw this like this. He's looking to the side, I guess. And it's really uneven. But yeah, you usually draw your eyes in between these two lines. <laughs> then your eyebrows, which would be above them a bit. He's I don't know ex what expression he's doing, I really don't. Ignore my art, it's crappy. Ignore this! You get my point. His nose is here in the front a bit. <laughs> you have a little gap here. Indentations just showing the front of the face. He got really thick, puffy lips, apparently. Ignore that, and I'm gonna define his chin more. Uh, which I'm messing up real bad. Spike it from there, making the face fluff. Because I'm bad at R E. And then here again, the circles for the ears. Should be at the sides. <laughs> I don't draw the style a lot, but it, it, it's a eh. It's a big eh. And a line, just to measure where your top of your ear should be, or should reach technically. There we go. Bend it there. Another wide circle. You got ears. Surprisingly, this is going really well. Other than that, if I was by myself thinking, drinking mu tea, and listening to music, this would not go well at all. It really wouldn't. More fluff. Just really crappy fluff. You can define it more if you want to to make it look like it's coming out from the side. Which I do all the time because I need to define my perspective because I'm not good at perspective. <laughs> and then a little bit more fluff because apparently his head was a little longer than I expected. A little hair, just a little because apparently he's a bald boy. And then the top of the head. Ignore the eyes. The eyes are messy. I cannot draw eyes because I cannot draw things even. I just am not good at that. Ignore that. So I... Do, let's do this. <clears throat> okay. This is much better. Will you get my point? I rouse... My ears are really perked and uneven again. You see this? This is this is not even. I'm not good at e making things even. I don't care if you copy and paste, but as long as you flip them, it's, it's, oof, I don't care. His head is still a bit long, which I need to fix that. Maybe it's because I'm drawing my circles to, like an oval, but that's a front way perspective. And that's it for this video of how to how to art or do a concept and this one is crappy compared to this one I don't know what I did there oh well uh, see you in the next one please like comment subscribe and I will see you